The Five Bloods is an intense and powerful movie about black Vietnam veterans and how the trauma of that tragic war affected the rest of their lives. The film is a history lesson, an action-adventure film, and a devastating drama with a stunning Oscar-worthy performance from 67-year-old actor Delroy Lindo. In World War II, 350,000 black men fought, and we were promised freedom, and we didn't get it. Now here we go with the damn Vietnam War, and we still ain't getting nothing but racist police brutality, etc. The film begins with a montage of clips from half a century ago, and then jumps to the present when four black vets excitedly reunite in what used to be Saigon. They've come back to recover the body of Norman, their fallen squad leader, and to find the trunk full of gold bars they buried during the war. There are several important flashbacks. The Bloods is back! In a bar named Apocalypse Now, three of the Bloods, which is what black soldiers called themselves, are shocked by what they learn about Delroy Lindo as Paul. No, 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 no! Don't tell me that you voted for President Fake Bones Bird. Yeah, I voted for him. On a journey upriver to their jungle destination, Paul tells Clark Peters, who plays Otis, that he's a broken man. Good, we're all broken. You're not like me. When a Vietnamese man pushes hard to sell Paul a chicken, he completely loses control and later tells his brothers that he can't shake the loss of their squad leader. I see ghosts, y'all. What happens to all of us, man? Have you seen him too? Yeah. Storm and Nam comes to me down there every night, man. He talked to you. Like you talk to me? Come on. I don't think so. Later in the film, we see just how traumatized Paul really is. In the jungle, the men suffer through one catastrophe after another, including a battle with some rogue Vietnamese officers who want to steal the gold they've recovered. One of the many powerful truths this film drives home is that a war never really ends for the people who fought in it. Terry Hunter, Hawaii News Now. Thank you.